This video tutorial is a step-by-step -step guide for Lorex DDNS registration. The first step is to create a MyLorex account or log in to your existing MyLorex account. Click MyLorex to open the MyLorex account login screen. Here, you can create a new account on the right or log in using an existing account on the left. To create a new account, fill in the required fields on the right and click Create Account. The second step is to register your product for warranty. After creating an account or logging in, click Warranties to open the Warranty page. Click Activate Warranty to register your product for warranty. Note, Warranty Registration is required to register for DDNS. On the Activate Warranty page, under your address, select an existing address or click Enter a new address to create a new address for selection. In the New Address pop-up window, fill in your address information and click Create Address. Fill in the warranty registration form with your product and purchase details. Check the sticker on your product for the product model number and serial number. Click Save Warranty. A page pops up to prompt you to register your product for Lorex DDNS. Click Set up a new DDNS. The third step is to register your product for Lorex DDNS. Fill out the My DDNS form with information about your product. Under Warranty, select the product warranty you created in Step 2. Under Device Name, enter a name for your device. You can enter your name, business name, or anything of your choice. This is used to identify this device in your list of activated DDNS accounts that appear any time you visit the DDNS page. Under MAC address, enter the MAC address of your Lorex product. See the manual or quick start guide of your product for details. A media access control address is a permanent, unique 12-digit address used to identify a device on a network. Under URL request, enter the website address that will be used to connect to your Lorex product. For example, if you enter Tom Smith, your product's website address will be http colon dash dash tomsmith.lorexddns.net. Note, if your product's HTTP or web port is anything other than port 80, you will need to enter colon and the HTTP or web port in the browser when you connect to your Lorex product. For example, if the HTTP or web port is 85, you will enter http colon dash dash tomsmith.lorexddns.net colon 85 to connect to your product. Click Save to register your product for DDNS. The following message will appear to confirm that your product has been registered for DDNS and a confirmation email will be sent to your email account. The last step is to enter the DDNS account information from the Lorex DDNS confirmation email into your Lorex product to activate DDNS. See the manual or quick start guide of your Lorex product for details. And you're done. You can now connect to your Lorex product and access its video from anywhere in the world.